Well, first, a huge thanks to all of you for being amazing members of Team Kentucky. In the past few months, we have been asked to step up to face numerous challenges in the face of COVID-19. You have shown that time and time again, Kentuckians are resilient. We are strong, but we are stronger when we work together and look out for one another. So I thank you for all that you have done to rise to the occasion and to keep yourselves, your families, and your neighbors safe during these unprecedented times. And with that, I'm so excited I get to ask Virginia to say to all of us out there, we will get through this. We will get through this together. Thank you, Virginia. Andy and Jacqueline have called upon you many times in the past few months to help those in need. Today, I ask for your help as we seek to support Kentucky students, educators, and staff. We are seeing rising numbers of COVID-19 cases in our children. As a parent, this is frightening, and I know you all feel the same. I know our teachers, faculty, and staff are worried about safety precautions, too. This is something Andy and Lieutenant Governor Jacqueline Coleman discuss daily. And because of these concerns, it's more important than ever that we are proactive in preparing our schools for a safe return when that time eventually comes. Guidelines state that staff and all students in first grade and above are required to wear a mask to school unless they have a medical condition that otherwise prohibits them. While wearing a mask is one of the best ways to stop the spread of COVID-19, there are circumstances where obtaining a mask may not be possible for everyone. This pandemic has impacted so many Kentucky families and we must try to reduce additional barriers to keeping our kids safe. That is why I am so excited to announce that I have teamed up with Lieutenant Governor Jacqueline Coleman to launch the Coverings for Kids initiative. We are seeking to collect mask donations, homemade or otherwise, to provide to Kentucky schools for students, educators, and staff at no cost to the school districts. These donations will help our schools and students be healthy and help ease the additional stress that some face during this time. And I'll note, although the name is Covering for Kids, we are hoping donations will include both child side coverings as well as adult for older students, teachers, and other staff members. And I'm a little disappointed that um, James is on the ball with, this, <laughs> with the slides because I've always wanted to say, next slide, Kenneth. But thank you, James, for having us ready to go. If you visit the link on the screen here, you will find more information on how to donate, as well as resources, mask-making tutorials, and guidelines for donation requirements. We have asked a lot of our schools, educators, and students in the past few months. Through Coverings for Kids, we have an amazing opportunity to come together once again as Team Kentucky and help the children and educators of our Commonwealth stay safe when they return to their classrooms. Even though that date is currently delayed, we must be proactive versus reactive, which is why we are coming to you now to ask for your help. I encourage you to donate if you can, and I look forward to working together in this effort. Thank you.